Josh takes some alone time at the pit, digging out a rock that he's hoping will change his luck. Hey, Dad. Yeah. It's nice enough for you to come look at. The crew arrives at the pit to see what Josh uncovered. This is hard right here. It's almost solid bottom here. Oh, that looks pretty good. No. <laughs> but Steve is not impressed. It doesn't go very down. deep, this. I don't know. No. <laughs> we'll see. And you don't think there's any jade behind here that it's connected to or nothing like that? Not to this piece. That's crazy that you can see that. We're all just guessing. There's nothing wrong with everybody having a opinion. It's awful trying to keep the peace. Our family, it's a powder keg sometimes. All right. With all due respect to my grandpa, his experience with hard rock jade mining is very limited. I would drill it. My dad has more hard rock experience than my grandpa. So I have a lot of faith in my dad. How much hard rock mining did you guys do? I'm just I'm just curious. Like, did you guys do a lot of it? Like, I'm no, just curious. you did, Josh. Come no, no, on. no, no, I'm asking. I'm, I'm wondering how much you guys, like, I'm not allowed to ask? I know how you ask him. Let me tell you something. Careful. Four years I was digging hard rock. Don't be mad, man. You don't have to be mad, buddy. Before I was just I asking you a question. No, no, you don't have to treat me like I'm stupid. Well, you got to learn. Josh, he's looking for respect. I said, no, you don't have any respect. You better earn that. Well, cut the small one and see what it is? Right on, fire it up. At two mile, Josh is eager to prove his grandfather wrong. Yeah. And show that his dad's pit contains sellable jade. Perfect. He and Gary are cutting a small sample from a section they discovered yesterday. I don't know why my grandpa is so stubborn with his opinion on the quality of the jade. As we dig deeper and deeper, it gets better and better. That's it. That's a nice color. Holy shit. Dad! Here, look at this. The color is there. The best part of it all is there's no fractures. Like it's none. Gone. Excellent color. So we know the jade is there. We just got to find the parts that have the best jade in it. Robin takes the crew back to the pit for another inspection. It is mostly all green. Holy cow. Where the f is the good stuff? That's is it right, right here? here. But Steve still doesn't like what he sees. Too crumbly. Look at here. Look at here. Yeah, that's just the outer edge. He's using a tooth on it to try to rip it out. The good stuff never crumbles like this. It will chew your teeth. And you know you got good jays. We'll know when we cut it. Yep. I think the best piece is over there. Steve continues to press the crew to move up to the ridge. Why, you would. You picked it. No, it's not because I picked it, but you can bring that piece here beside any one of these, and then you know. Although we value his opinion, we can't change our mind plan just because he thinks something. And <laughs> just 100 feet from here, that's the real cover that we are after. Everybody knows more about Jay than me. Yeah, I don't know anything, but I never failed one year. This particular rock out of the ones we're doing is the hardest rock yet. Everybody has their own opinion, but at the end of the day, it's my decision. So if they don't like it, they know where their home is. What's out, Stu? Where do you want to put it? Back at camp. Like here? Robin has brought down another big rock. That'll work? Yeah. Despite Steve's advice to abandon the pit and move up the ridge. OK, get her up to full speed. Bring her up. At two mile, it's the moment they've been waiting for. There. Oh, Jesus. Is it solid? This nodule surface is no good. But color is great. Oh, yeah, tons of green. Eh, not so good. But the quality still isn't good enough for Steve. You're focusing on the wrong half of the rock. This bottom half could be great quality. You're just missing the green because it's cloudy. Oh, I don't like what I see. Nothing there. You're digging, wasting time. But hey. I'm always stuck in the middle of everything because I sort of mediate everything so that it doesn't get out of control. We're doing amazing. We're finding great jade. Every cut I make is awesome quality, awesome color. Wow, look at that. Oh, gorgeous color. 
pretty, eh? No, that's the goods. Yep. We're on to Jade. No. We're on it. No. Gotta come better than that. What? For you, you've seen the best and cut yeah. the best out. Yeah. This, for us, is probably the best that we've ever dug out. Leave that for a while and dig here. It's much easier. Steve puts more pressure on Claudia to move to the ridge. Sometimes I believe what my dad says is right. Sometimes I believe what Robin says is right. Let's try to do that. And do it. Let's try to do that. This time, I think that we need to follow my dad. Well, it's up to you, but it's a lot of work. I think Grandpa wants to fulfill knowing what that is. This is your is. business. Like, just Joshua. make, but listen, make a Listen, listen, she asked me a question. We don't need your answers. Get me a chopper. Oh, f I'm okay. I'm leaving. OK, goodbye. I can't I'm going to go. Yeah. I'm not doing it with you three every damn fucking day. Well, my dad um, decided to leave camp. I said 20 times I want to cut that rock. That's right. Neither one and of them. Their idea is haul it out the way it is. You're going to haul a ton and a half of garbage. It's heartbreaking. For me, it was really important this year that my dad and my son and husband, that we all work together. This is my dad's money. And if we're going to fail here, it's going to be my dad's decision. And if we're going to succeed here, it's going to be my dad's decision. Nobody else's. So if my grandpa had to go because he couldn't deal with not being in charge here, then he's got to go.